Hey, baby. How's it going, sweetheart? Hun, why are you coming in all loud and out? You know that I don't like that. Now is my time to watch ASMR? What is that again? Never mind. Ooh. Is something wrong? No, why? Why you think so? Well, you came in all loud and announced. You didn't even give me a kiss when you got home. Yeah. And well, what's the problem? You can't even give me so much as a smooch when walking through the door. I mean... Well, I mean... Work? Work? Yeah. You know? What do you do at work that's so tiring and, and annoying? <sighs> Compared to what I do, you know? Well, Aaron, <laughs> sweetheart, um, you know, um, well, I mean, work can be, I mean, especially my kind, uh, it's, uh, pretty draining. You know, just... Really draining work, you know? Uh, okay. I guess draining? <laughs> okay, like that <sighs> tells me anything. I mean, we've been dating for eight months and I don't even know anything about your career. I mean, wh I don't even know what you do. <sighs> one, one second, Spirit. Oh, it's a big coat, you know? <laughs> gotta, oof. Gotta get cozy. Sorry, wait. What? Oh, <laughs> what do you say again? <laughs> I know I know you don't like repeating yourself, but can I just say it one more time? I said I don't even know what you do. We've been dating for eight months, and <sighs> yeah, what is it? Well, it's a little hard to describe, sweetie, but um, it's a uh, well, you know the work itself, it's kind of, it, it's, uh, it's kind of dirty, you know, so. Dirty. <laughs> yeah, it's dirty. Sure to tell the guy that some dope head he uh, got into the stuff. Yeah, let our associate know. I don't know how much he got, just some of it. See you soon. Fucking Christ. You know, Sven. This is this is not fair at all. I mean, please, baby, let's not do this now, please. You know about my job. You know about the stuff that I do to pay for my half of the rent. That you didn't pay last month because of that business expenditure with the website not getting enough traction, so I had to put down a good hundred dollars just to keep the domain up. I, lo I love you, baby. I love your ideas, your business. Just let's not forget that. Hey, are you talking about my ocean flavored candles? Maybe. I sold at least 10 last week. I, I know, but the fresheners, the, what was it, the Guatemalan cacti car fresheners. The positive affirmations, smelling candles as well? 
<sighs> yeah, Jared, it's just not working. It's it, not it was a business go. expense. That's different. Hey, hey, hey sweet. <laughs> I know, I know you love your your uh, what's the interior decorative design? De decorative design. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, <laughs> let's keep our um, uh, expectations real thin. You know what I'm saying, sweetheart? Are you kidding? That's what you're gonna go with here? Seriously. Even okay. with the manufactured cactus needles that I gave you two days ago when I didn't have to, because those are mine. Okay, sweetie. It was ten bucks for extra shipping, okay? I, <laughs> like you I don't understand. even understand, obviously, but <laughs> I, I do. Okay, yeah. Okay, so job. Have an issue with that. Anything else, Aaron? Don't even get me started on family, okay? I mean, I mean, you know about my corgis, Tutu and Juju, my, my two sisters, mm -hmm. my, my foreign exchange student that I, I, I housed back in middle school that I've known yeah. for years, but you haven't even told me or, or shown me any of your relatives, and I, I don't even know what to say. Because, sweetheart, <laughs> Aaron, it's best left unsaid. Ah, uh, sir, sir, please, no smoking in the facility. Is he in there? Yes, and unlike last time, please, please watch your profanities. I know you come here every week, but it's every single time. Especially the use of the R word. Uh, what, what was that one again? Uh... Retard? You know, I warn you about this every single time. You come here every week and you always make it so difficult. What is wrong? Well, maybe it wouldn't be so difficult if you people didn't try separating me from my brother. We, I mean, I, what? I, legal I, guardianship and I can't even have that? I'm doing my job. I d God. Yeah, I guess to stick up your ass is further up there today, huh? Beats you. Okay. Unsaid. Yeah. Eight months of dating, and that's all you can say. Or how about this? Maybe, maybe this is better, sweetie. Um, how about I just don't want to talk about it? Hey, buddy. How you doing? Hey, Evan. It's been a while, little bro. You know I like to see you and something's a bit spontaneous, you know, right? Yeah, um, well, I know today I'm seeing you because you're my little bro. I love you, you know. Um, can you think of uh, any particular reason as to why I'd be here today? Because I was acting retarded again. What? No, no, C come on, man. You know that... Okay, I heard about it from the orderly and the phone call from the facility. Look, look, buddy, look, you, you're fine. You don't need to feel bad about it. The, the little bastard had it coming. Who says that word to someone that's a, you know, your, you know, your kind, kind of people, folks. You know, it's like saying a slur to any other kind of group of people. You know, you're not in trouble. In fact, you did the right thing. That's what your bigger brother would have done. So I, I taught you well. Guess he was a bit mean. But maybe I'm just like Dad said. I am a bit slow. Oh I'm my God! This, fucking stop it, Evan. Okay, I don't want to. I don't want you ever thinking that you're retarded or whatever, because you're not. Okay, you're the smartest person I know, okay? You're, you're my little brother for God's sake, I love you. Honest to God truth, and you're the smartest out of both of us. You, you know, when we were younger and other stuff like that too, and all that, you're, you're smart. Do you think of all the times that you saved my ass when we were younger? So, don't, don't ever think of yourself as that. I've told you that for years, and don't, don't ever fucking think what dad says. He was never around. 
It's bullshit. You're plenty fucking smart, and you fucking know what you're doing, buddy. You know what you're doing. But, uh, but the way you gotta see it is just, you see and think things differently. And sometimes I'm sorry if that means it looks like I'm annoyed because of it, but that should be just, <laughs> that's just because, buddy, I have a hard time understanding it, you know? And that doesn't mean that there's something wrong with me either, you know? We just, a little learning curve, there's little hiccups, but it's completely all right to be this way. You know that. Well, um, <laughs> sweetheart, um, you know, just family stuff, you know I mean? Nothing big, nothing you miss out on, not by knowing anyone or anything like that. I mean, you get it. Besides, why don't you work on your little candles and I'll go get some rest. Hey. Sven. No. I mean, sometimes it feels like you live a double life or something, okay? I hardly even know you. What the hell is that supposed to mean, Aaron? <laughs> what, what is that? What do you mean by that? What is there to know? You know everything. Mostly. Okay, uh, for one, your, your job is dirty. Two, there's no family I don't even know about. I mean, okay, does your job even contribute to the world in any way or, or make people happy like mine? Yes, it does. I can say 110% you'd be happy because it's like charity work, okay? The smiles on the faces, it is a positive job. That's what I'm talking about. Let's see what we got. Oh yeah. Ooh. Ooh. That's good. Not too shabby, looks like the little dope head didn't even take a pinch. Must have been quick on the draw, huh? Business here is concluded. For now. Trust me, I won't forget your great capabilities for cold-blooded murder, not to mention your quick meal work. clientele's face, they're extremely happy with the services I provide. Daddy's gold. Ooh. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Ah, oh, fuck it. Ah. Whoa! 
Whoa! Whoa! Hell yeah! Hell yeah! Whoa. Whoa. That's what I'm talking about! Yeah! Yeah! Oh. He did not, he did not mess up with this. He did not. Oh. fucking questions, right? That's what you get to fucking do, being like, oh, I get to question this. So when I start finally fucking opening up about it, then you start posing all these questions and then start laughing it off like I'm fucking lying. What's the point then in even telling the truth? If you just think it's a lie, and you're gonna take the piss out of it out of the way. How about fucking that? What are you gonna say that? Or you got, you got everything to say to something? Come on, let's hear it. Let's hear it, let's hear it. I am waiting for your brilliant response, sweetie. I don't appreciate the tone. Fine, I'll dial it back. Yes, dial it back, simmer it down, talk to me normally. Okay. Okay? Yep. Okay. Sorry. Okay. No more secrets, Sven. Especially when it involves you coming home like this. Where's my attention? Huh? Sven? Huh? You know, lots of people have it a lot harder than you, Sven. Okay? I mean, there, there are people who are African American, there are trans people, there, there are gay people, and especially disabled people. I'm gay, Aaron. We're both gay. Well, you get that one. But when it comes to everything else, People have it a lot worse than you. What did you say? People have it a lot worse. You're just like every other guy I've dated. Privileged. <laughs> oh no, too much of a big fucking ego to admit it. <laughs> Get over yourself. Admit that everyone else is not the problem. It's you. This is all out of your system, Aaron? Yeah, it is. Okay. I think it is. It all is? Yeah. Maybe you want to sit fucking down and hear it! Sit the fuck down! You want to know about me? Well, sit the fuck down! No! It's time that you fucking listen! Before next time I hear some stupid fucking word like privilege and who the fuck's got it worse, you wanna hear about me? <laughs> you wanna hear about your boyfriend? Sure, I'll tell you. So, I grew up in Flint fucking Michigan. Ever heard of it? The water's so fucking dirty, you drink it and you fucking die! Yeah, that's not to mention that, uh, uh, what was it? Yeah, no mom growing up. Yeah, she was gone, died of an overdose, and I had my abusive dad beat the shit out of me and my disabled younger brother. Do you know how fucking hard it is doing that? Especially when you're fucking homeless? And then next thing you know, you have to fucking, I don't know, kill people to get a fucking roof over your head. After your dad's done fucking beating your back with a fucking belt. But no, I'm, I'm, I'm privileged. I'm just fucking privileged! And you really want to know who I am, Sven? You really want to fucking know? Well, I'll let you fucking know. You okay. see these hands? You want to talk about dirty work? I use these to fucking kill people! What you're looking at? Oh no, it isn't just some 
sweet fucking boyfriend or anything like that. I killed my first fucking person with this right hand around his goddamn throat when I was fucking 14. Yeah. Yeah, the tears coming down with that one, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and uh, all the money uh, going into this shithole fucking apartment. You know, it's uh, it goes to that from the jobs. Okay, I'm sorry. But then, the, then my brother, like I said, he's disabled. But um, I have life fucking easy. Okay. <laughs> Please. I mean, look at all this shit, Aaron. Look at fucking this. I fucking paid for all of this stupid shit. Interior fucking design, my fucking ass. But, um, hey, you got the truth now. You got the truth, Aaron, so, uh, why don't you get the fuck out of here since I pay for all this shit anyway? No, please, hey. <laughs> get the fuck out. Do I need to fucking remind you what I do with these hands? The dirty fucking work. Okay, please. Hey, do, you, do you know how many people I fucking killed? <laughs> Yeah, who gives a shit? Just like any other boy I've been with. Fuck them in the ass, complains about their dad, their mommy, whatever fucking issues. So go, hit the door. Hit the fucking door. Go on. Good boy. <laughs> Come on, go. Go. I think we both made mistakes today, okay? And I've been practicing self-love and respect, and I can't let this be a sign of aggression. <laughs> so, okay, okay. We'll give it a week. We'll see. I'll send you a text or a phone call. If you don't get it a week from now, things are done. Are your guys' visitation hours still open for the facility? Yeah, the assisted living facility. <sighs> yeah, I was just making sure because it's, it's getting a little late. Um, yeah, I was just going to see my little bro, Evan, um, take him out for a little rendezvous. Oh, they are? Okay, yeah, <laughs> that, uh, that sounds good. Thanks. Bye. All right.
fucking know. Should I? Get sleep easier at night, that's for damn sure, but... That pay. Can't, it can't fucking be that bad. Shouldn't even be thinking this over some stupid fucking boy. No offense, buddy. I mean, you picked the, the wrong time after a winter storm. I don't think we're gonna see her anywhere, man. All that white. Now get down from there before you hurt yourself, bud. I like the view. Evan. Love you, Ma. Bye, Ma. You know, I bet somewhere up above right now, buddy, she's smiling in the sky, looking down on you all proud. Proud of you, too? Well, how do I say this? Probably not, Evan. Let's go. Come on, bud. So loose, loose. 